Hello, friends, and welcome to Godly Play with Home Moravian Church. I'm Margaret Norris, and this is the Sea of Galilee. So many important things happened there that we needed to have a piece of it here. Sometimes the wind is calm and the waves are smooth. Other times when the wind blows hard, the waves get large. There were so many people who wanted to see Jesus, who wanted to hear Jesus, who wanted to be close to Jesus, that he asked his disciples if they could go out in the boat for him to preach. And so they did. And when that time was done, he suggested that they go across the water. Jesus was very tired. He fell asleep. The wind started to blow and the waves started to get bigger. And the disciples found themselves in the middle of a very big storm. They didn't know what to do. And Jesus still was asleep in the back. And finally, they said to him, Jesus, do you care whether we're going to perish? Jesus woke up. Jesus said to the wind, be still. Jesus said to the waves, be still. And suddenly, everything was still. The disciples wondered how even the wind and the waves obeyed Jesus. I wonder what it was like to be a part of such a great storm. I wonder how the wind and the waves felt to the disciples. I wonder how it was that Jesus was able to sleep even through such a big storm. I wonder how the disciples felt when they saw what Jesus did. I wonder what your favorite part of the story is. The stories in the Bible. I'm going to light the Christ candle to remind us that Jesus is with us as we hear it. If you listen carefully, you'll hear the match strike. You can tell we're near the end of the Bible. So it's the New Testament and it's a story about Jesus. It's in the Gospel of Mark, chapter 4. It's verses 35 through 41. Later that day, when evening came, Jesus said to them, meaning the disciples, let's cross over to the other side of the lake. They left the crowd and took him in the boat just as he was. Other boats followed along. 
gale force winds arose and waves crashed against the boat so that the boat was swamped. But Jesus was in the rear of the boat, sleeping on a pillow. They woke him up and said, teacher, don't you care that we're drowning? He got up and gave orders to the wind, and he said to the lake, silence, be still. The wind settled down, and there was a great calm. Jesus asked them, why are you frightened? Don't you have faith yet? Overcome with awe, they said to each other, who then is this? Even the wind and the sea obey him. Let's pray together. Jesus, thank you for your presence with the disciples. They called to you and you were there. Thank you for your presence with us. In your name we pray. Amen. And just as Jesus once was in one place, and now is in all places. This light, which has been in one place, now will be in all places. Amen.